Hi friends, I'm glad you're here. I hope you enjoyed the book by Peter Spires titled People. So today we're here to talk about the fundamental human needs. And a fundamental human need is a need that is common to all people. All people have a common need and that need is the desire to survive. The desire to survive leads to other needs common to all people. Those needs might be material or spiritual. Material needs are our physical well-being and spiritual needs might be the desire to know the meaning of life. So we're gonna go ahead and look at these needs and some of the ways that they've been satisfied over the years and also in different areas by different people. So we're starting here on the material side. We're going to start with nourishment. Nourishment might be satisfied with plants, we know we definitely need beverages such as water. And nourishment may also be satisfied with meat. Another material need that everyone has is for shelter. Long ago, that need may have been met by a cave or a teepee or more recently, a house. The next fundamental need on the material side that I'd like to tell you about is defense. Defense is a need that people satisfied from the beginning of time. They might have defended themselves against wild animals using, we using weaponry or barricades, and today, more so technology. The last fundamental need on the material side that I'd like to share with you is for clothing. People needed clothing to protect themselves from the weather, and that need was satisfied long ago with animal skins, and today more so with cloth. Moving to the spiritual side, again, the spiritual side, looking for meaning in life, we start with our first fundamental need on the spiritual side, art. Art can be satisfied in many ways, but a few examples long ago, paintings, cave paintings, and certainly paintings today, literature, and dance, to name a few. The next spiritual need I'd like to talk about is religion. People have always wanted to know the reason for life, why, where they've come from and where they're going. This has created a desire and a need for the divine. For, because of this reason, people created many different types of religions and philosophies. And that religion need may be met in a mosque, a church, or a temple. The next spiritual need that I'd like to show you is for self-adornment. And that's just wanting to look good for yourself or for others. Some of the ways that that is satisfied is with costumes, skin markings, and jewelry. The last spiritual need that we'll discuss today is for community. The need to belong to a group. That might be a tribe, a work group, and definitely a family. 
So friends, I challenge you to create your own fundamental human needs chart. I will send you a picture, and of course, you're welcome to look back at this video as much as needed.